ஓம் வெல்கம் டு ஆல் டுடே இட்ஸ் அபவுட் த ட்ரான்ஸிட் ஆஃப் தி ஃபார் த மந்த் ஆஃப் அக்டோபர் அக்டோபர் வில் ஆக்சுவலி டர்ன் த கார்ட்ஸ் ஓப்பன் இன் ஃப்ரண்ட் ஆஃப் அஸ் எஸ் ஒன் பை ஒன் நவ் ஆல் தி பிளானெட்ஸ் ஆர் கெட்டிங் டைரெக்ட் ஸ்டார்ட் வித் ப்ளூட்டோ சேட்டர்ன் அண்ட் மர்க்யூரி இன் திஸ் மந்த் தட் இஸ் அக்டோபர் ஃபாலோட் பை ஜூபிட்டர் இன் நவம்பர் நெப்டியூன் இன் டிசம்பர் Mars and Uranus in January 2023 and by end of January 2023 we shall have all the planets in direct motion expect gradual forward movement in your important and major task with October when a planet is in direct motion after a long retrogression for the slow moving planet then it's the powerful time where we can start progressing in almost every area of our lives earlier while in retrograde motion there were delays obstacles almost no clarity in nearly everything that we take upon nothing was moving forward now with direct motion we have a green signal to take a step forward time will move faster now and the speed of life will move forward it's beginning to start having results of our work done and patience regain your confidence it's important to know this and use this time well numerologically october is the 10th month of the year 10 is all about ending and a new beginning expect completeness totality success and achievement at some level with this october month basically number 10 brings change and symbolizes completion of a cycle do not categorize good or bad as its reflection will be in direct proportion of what you did in earlier months only you know what you have done in earlier months and the next couple of months 2 3 months you can expect the results as per your previous actions number 10 has the power to create new things also which in turn gives changing impact on everyone things won't be the same after this month there can be a start of something new at some level emotionally mentally or in the actual form but much of october we have mercury saturn and pluto slow and stationary giving us a pause before they start giving results we had less transit in the month of september but october is full of new planetary transits at the beginning of the month earth element will be dominant along with virgo as a prominent sign loaded with sun debilitated venus making neech bhang raj yog with exalted mercury and that is till 17th and 18th of september the impact can be mostly positive as jupiter's aspect will help in being optimistic towards any change coming your way but health should be watched carefully during this time as virgo being the sixth sign of the natural zodiac if we observe the calendar of the october the month starts with almost stationary mercury and pluto trying to each other closely this can change and impact positively and intensely our thinking communication and psychology it's best to welcome new ideas and different style to handle the existing matters then on 2nd of october mercury gets direct in virgo at 0.02 degrees at the age of the beginning of virgo sign direct mercury will resolve disputes speed up your documentation travel plans can bring clarity and clears any misunderstanding which happened because of retrograde mercury you will be in a better position to execute your major task and take important decisions and on 9th of october pluto will be direct in capricorn at 1.56 degrees with this there will be motivation to break through strong barriers that were holding you back to make any modifications 
which was very important for your own growth especially in and within your career we have saturn and uranus square modifying our work patterns completely also giving challenges in the significations of saturn in our chart we have saturn aspecting ketu and now it is separating aspect with changing degrees which may create relief and may open new doors in the work area to enhance this transformation on the 10th of october we have full moon in pisces revti nakshatra at 22 degrees this full moon may bring completion achievement or an end of some major task which you have been trying for a long time and this can be a fresh start as moon will also simultaneously cross pisces gandanta and will enter aries Uranus is also in sixth seat relation with Virgo sign, where we have Sun, Venus, and Mercury. This is capable of giving sudden and unexpected impact. This can probably be the starting point of any change that will come your way. You are good as far as you don't resist any change and keep up with your calm and patient approach. Then on sixteenth of October. action and fiery planet mars will enter gemini you may experience some smart mindful action as with gemini mars we can have brilliant ideas and courageous communication with action though for a short while mars will be very slow and moves just a degree till 30th of october before getting retrograde in gemini Mars in Gemini may show you the probable future at a mental level in thoughts or by forming ideas or plan about something major which can take shape only when Mars will be direct by March 2023 then on 17th of October sun transits to its debilitated sign Libra by making niche bhang raj yog with venus as the very next day venus will join sun in libra sun has too much fire and ego which can make you dry on emotions we also have ketu in libra and relations can be weak and libra is all about cordial relations venus in libra on 18th of october can be a savior here but ketu is in libra where we have combust venus for a long time so keeping a diplomatic approach and harmonious relation can be the key to handle this transit well another important transit is on 18th of october and this is very important ketu in swati nakshatra and rahu in bharani pada 2 with ketu in vishakha in past 8 months you must have had some new path or alternative solutions to your problems now ketu in swati rahu's nakshatra makes a very strong connection rahu will have upper hand here with our worldly approach materialistic side of life business and relations will have a major impact you may find greater integration of diverse elements relationships and values to bring balance and harmony that is signified by libra this can easily happen by letting go reflection and self realization signified by ketu this tendency will increase as ketu will be now in pisces navamsha and rahu will be in virgo navamsha for next 2 months both are dignified in navamsha the internal feeling will be very satisfactory and delightful with positive energy this can be the best position for rahu and ketu in navamsha and the best part will be finally now ketu will cross the exaltation point of saturn in libra ketu is done with its job related to saturn jupiter and their significations like all types of relations wisdom 
and work related matter the lessons need to be remembered now and practiced in the time ahead another significant transit will be on 23rd of october we have a degree conjunction of sun and venus and from here venus will move forward from sun expect gradual relief in all the significance of venus like relation love beauty charm of life and grace in our life along with finance prosperity luxuries and comfort of life will improve as now venus will work independently without strong and fiery influence of sun also the very next day on 24th of october saturn will be direct in capricorn at 24 degrees slowly and gradually your work career and other significance of saturn like health land related matters will come back on track with this two important events of venus slowly transiting ahead of sun and saturn in its direct motion will change the environment completely see the series of events now the next day on 25th of october we have new moon in libra swati nakshatra at 7 degrees there will be a new start after all those changes which happened earlier and endings even new moon may bring new opportunities for everyone and to work on all kinds of personal and professional relations to add fuel to this energy on 26th of october mercury will transit libra mercury in libra will emphasize more on sharing ideas exchanging thoughts discussing and not debating before coming to any conclusion mercury in libra is all about balancing the relations with right and friendly communication it's best to remain cordial with people around you around this time towards end of the month gradually the focus transfers to libra sign where ketu will welcome one by one sun venus and mercury giving that final closure to the matter at hand so you see as the planets will transit forward they will come on the radar of saturn uranus and rahu all together making a powerful impact on their significance to trigger events also they will make close conjunction with ketu at the beginning of november things that had started while these planets were in conjunction with rahu back in april may and june 2022 those matter can see closure or they can be at their final stage lastly at the end of the month on 31st of october mars will get retrograde in gemini at 1 degree mars is just touching gemini and goes back to finish some unfinished task of the taurus sign in your chart mars will be just moving within that initial 1 degree of gemini in mrigashira its own nakshatra and 611 lord for gemini ascendant both are upjaya houses 6 and 11 so i expect some positive futuristic vision which most probably be realized when mars will be in direct motion in gemini by march 2023 let us see for each ascendant what we can expect for the month of october where there can be some change or forward shift in the situation check closely the sign placement of virgo and libra in your chart as most events are happening around these signs and their opposite sign pisces and aries i'll be sharing the few most prominent areas of impact but you may relate to the activities that you are trying to pursue for past few months especially from early 2022 you may experience some movement or shift in those areas of your life start with aries aries can i expect some development in your work area marital life 
along with your relationship with rest of the world it is everything related to the changes in your day to day activities your focus will be more on fitness health controlling your expenses and the matter related to foreign countries will be in the focus and you may have to balance your identity and independence with that of others taurus the area of focus for you will be your work area job creativity stock market foreign travel expenses and matter related to your children your hobbies and all the pleasure giving activities the way you enjoy may change now and also the people that you engage with you may try to have stability in your daily life your spending and your work life balance gemini expect reshaping on the home front property vehicles your roots mother and the foundation of your value system may need some reworking you need to work on balancing the same with your career and also your personal pleasures and skills versus that of your friends and your networks try and keep up with your enthusiasm as always cancer you need to alter the way you communicate avoid emotional fights or conflicts while communicating traveling and recreate your bond within your family expect redesigning of your house your transportation and shuffle in your work zone expressing your thoughts in writing can be very helpful and aim at balancing your family private life versus that of your public and career life leo you may reflect on how you value your possessions health family and work on polishing your communication and sharing your ideas expect some change in your eating habits which can bring good health you desperately look for change and expanding your horizons virgo october may reshape your self image your finances health and best time to welcome any change that is needed for your personal development you may work on maintaining a stable income good relations partnerships and managing your finances well most probably you will be able to achieve what you are looking for since very long time libra you have been trying hard with everything around to make things work and support yourself you can know better by researching and self realization gradually you will find clarity and a way out to make those tough decisions in your life expect major correction reordering in your life and in your thought process and helping others updating with new learnings can actually heal you internally do make new fitness goals and mold at each level prepare yourself for a grand new beginning scorpio you may get what you have desired for a long time you may find new ways to manage this strong energy in everyone's interest including your friends and your extended circle let go of any fixed approach that you are holding on there can be a new development in your travel to a foreign country or a long vacation that you have been desiring your dreams can come true related to your career but it's time to invest your time and energy in managing your finances and expenses in a better way sagittarius major breakthrough in your work area your public life you will be very action oriented during this time looking for a new opportunity and power and status in your career zone your business tags and communication skills will be finally recognized to fulfill all your desires in the coming time there can be clear focus goal and successful venture with financial gains capricorn you may reevaluate your perspective on life and the world in general there can be long distance travel higher education do respect and consider the opinion of elders teachers of your life 
best time for you to be strong and clear in your approach make necessary changes in your work style by taking some constructive steps work hard but also pay equal attention to your family and your own well being your own peace of mind aquarius you are longing for change regulation and new developments for a very long time october may find you a refreshing way to expand your limits and open new ways to manage your finances reduce your fear and improve some risk taking tendencies best time for you to be adaptable emphasize on new learnings communicating and also start planning for some movement travel and new adventure pisces there can be new connections fruitful collaborations both at personal and professional level make sure you make a confident move forward and use your past experiences and evaluate the way you relate with others in relation encourage yourself with change wherever it is needed you may get some easy finances and your resources will improve you need to be in perfect balance with yourself and others that's all about all 12 ascendants to summarize the entire month of october has fluctuating and changing energies the earth trine taurus virgo capricorn is very active throughout the month that is the material side of life our finances health work and relations be watchful of being stubborn fault finding or have criticism over others work you can easily get into conflicts with sun venus and mercury in virgo sign the natural sixth sign of the zodiac it is necessary to be patient understanding and mindful to have a fair approach as that's what is going to work in favor for you try and aim to achieve peace with an objective outlook also be diplomatic and fair in your approach do what is expected from your side without getting into any pride or ego clash avoid conflicts at all the levels most importantly do not resist any change because the theme of this month is all about transforming things to grow and to move forward in your life be open for any makeover and the rest will certainly follow best wishes to everyone with the month of october thank you for your time do write in your comments and queries and i'll see you all soon thank you